I'm enjoying Black Ops 3 too much. I'm enjoying Black Ops 3 to the point to where pretty much my sleeping schedule has been destroyed because of it. My sleeping schedule before was like, you know, I'd stay up till like maybe midnight and then I'd wake up at about 9 a.m. Ever since Black Ops 3 came out, though, my sleeping schedule is pretty much, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and uh, stay up till 7, 8 a.m. and sleep till 2 in the afternoon. It's kind of bad. I haven't enjoyed a game since, like, GTA 5 came out. Like, really enjoyed the game for what it is. Thank you, David Vondahar, for actually making a game that's actually, um, not Ghost. I'm not even going to talk about, uh, Bunny Hop Simulator 2014. I'm not even going to talk about that game. That game, no. Now that I finally got my PS4 back since my old one broke, I actually want to start gaming again. Like, lately I had just been getting bored on PS3. It, it was just not fun anymore. I played everything. It, it just wasn't fun. As soon as I get my PS4, though, I'm over here, you know, playing till 8 a.m. in the morning. Shouldn't this fire kill me? Oh, wait, no, I'm a purifier, so I have a fireproof suit. I think the purifier probably has the best uh, specialist weapon. Then again, I am hearing a lot about the scythe. I heard the scythe is pretty overpowered if you know how to use it. But I don't know, I think nothing can really beat the purifier considering all you have to do is hit them by one little tiny bit and they're done. Or gravity spikes, because you know what, you're really that close. Watch this, watch this, bullshit. I was behind that wall, and he got me. I am on Christmas break, so when I do get off Christmas break, I'm not even sure how I'm going to adjust to waking up at 6 a.m. How am I going to adjust from going to sleep at 6 a.m. to waking up at 6 a.m.? Like, are you fucking... Oh, it's going to suck. The first few days are just going to be so bad. But my opinion of Black Ops 3 so far is, honestly, it's a pretty fun game, but I, uh, I noticed, like, the only map I don't like is Metro. Metro is just so... I don't know, it just doesn't flow right on this game. Yep, so obviously I'm a Christmas noob that has a 2.42 KD. The only thing I can honestly complain about in this game is the internet connection is sometimes beautiful and then other times it just... It, the whole lobby just spikes to one bar. I feel like the sweatiest gun in this game is probably the Vesper or any shotgun. And shotguns, I don't know why, but they are just so douchey in this game, dude. I just called it. There was a Vesper shooting at me, and here comes a shotgun to destroy my day. I'm not even sure why I play Team Deathmatch. Look at my team. 1 in 15, 4 in 10. I don't care what anyone says, that was a quad feed. Is it just me or does this gun seem like it has the iron sights of the ballista from Black Ops 2? Like, do, tell me this does not look like the ballista, bro. Speaking of the ballista from Black Ops 2, I absolutely hated quickscoping in, in Black Ops 2. It was so annoying, it was just so overpowered, all you had to do was aim and shoot. Luckily they kind of fixed it in this game to where, you know, quickscoping isn't, uh, you know, the easiest thing in the world. They took off aim assist, which was a thing that pretty much made Black Ops 2 sniping super easy. Alright, so I found a big list of questions, like really stupid questions that kind of make you think, but let me just read a couple of these off. Why doesn't glue stick to the inside of the bottle? Why is it that rain drops but snow falls? Do illiterate people get the full effect of alphabet soup? What effect? If they squeeze olives to get olive oil, how do they get baby oil? Blenders. Yep. 